Hello friends, my name is Ritu Sachdev. In the last tutorial, we have created a navigation bar which was fixed from the top. Now in this tutorial, I am gonna show you how you can change the color of that navigation bar. In fact, later I will also show you how you can add more color to your bootstrap website by applying few themes to them. Before we start, let me preview up the things which we are going to create in this tutorial. See here, this is a navigation bar which I have created in my last tutorial. Now in this tutorial, I am gonna change the color of this navigation bar just by changing a single class which is also a pre-written in bootstrap. Later we will apply few themes to our web page. See here, this is the same web page which has been applied few themes. There are so many themes which you can apply to your web page. Just for the demo, I am using three themes. So let's get started. Here I have already opened up Adobe Dreamware and the document in which we are going to work. I have created this document in my last tutorial. Fix navigation bar. Let me show you up if you want to know how I have created this navigation bar. Here it is, my last tutorial. Responsive and fixed menu bar or navigation bar, whatever you say. Now, let me show you up the preview for this navigation bar. Here it is, the preview for this document. This is a default navigation bar with what we have created in earlier tutorial. Now we will change the color of this navigation bar. Let me go to source code. Here on the line number 18, I have applied a class navbar-default. Now to this default class, I am changing it to inverse. Now let's save it up and let me show you up the changes. Let me refresh this page. See the default navigation has been inversed. We have a navigation bar in little greyish color and the active class is in black color which we have applied to our home item. Here it is. Ally class active on the home. You can learn all this coding of mine in my last tutorial. To save the time, I am not gonna redo it. Just I am focusing on changing the colors and themes of web pages in Bootstrap. Now when I hover on the name of company, it also gets brighter. When I hover on other links, they also gets brighter. Now let's learn how we can add more themes to our web pages in Bootstrap. I have created this button to show you the difference how the default color for this buttons gonna change when we will apply theme to this web page. That will also change the color of this navigation bar. We will have a complete new look and feel for this web page when we will apply these themes. If you want to know how I have created this button, again you can watch. There is a tutorial of mine on it on my channel. Here it is. Bootstrap 3.2.0 creating Jumbotron layout and buttons. So you will find complete coding for this button. How to create this type of buttons. Now to add theme let us go to a web page. Here it is bootswatch.com. Inside it in the themes tab when you will click there are several themes you can apply to your web page. Let us go for this first theme, Cerulean. I don't know exactly how you pronounce it. Let us click on Cerulean. See, this will be the look for our web page now if we are going to apply this theme. We have a preview here on this web page itself. And these are the sheds for the buttons which I have created to show you. This will be the color of navigation bar. 
Now to have this theme, we will go to download section. Inside download, here it is bootstrap min.css dot min dot css now as I'm using CDN but if you are using downloaded file with you for this minified version of bootstrap just you can replace all this coding with yours but as I'm using CDN so let me copy the URL address for this web page and let me go to my source code inside Dreamweaver now where I have a optional theme I have copied this CDN from official website in the last tutorial getbootstrap.com now in the line number 11 on the href let me paste the URL address which we have copied let me replace it actually here it is now we are linked up with bootswatch.com and the cerulean theme and bootstrap.min.css now let's save it up let's refresh our web page see we have a complete new look for our web page and the sheds of this button has been also changed now let us try some other theme let us again go to our web page bootswatch.com let me hit back now inside theme let us pick some other theme say if I want to go for this sandstone theme you can again see the preview right for all these tables buttons how these things are going to react in our web page how these sheds are going to behave now let us go to download here it is bootstrap min.css I'm just again copying the URL address again we will change our URL address let's just replace it let's save it up now let's refresh our page see now we have a complete new look in our web page Now let us try one more last theme. Again go to bootswatch.com. Let me pick up this theme sled this time. See this sled theme will add a background color to your web page. A grayish background color and the shades for this button are totally different. for this tables also so let us go to download section copy this URL address for bootstrap.min.css again go to our line number 11 let me change this URL address let's save it up now let's refresh see this is the slide theme we have applied to our web page so this is how you can play all with this cool theme in bootstrap let me tell you one more thing if you are not happy with these themes you can also browse for premium themes here is the premium themes you can go for that so this is done friends and if you like this video of mine do thumbs it up do share it and if you want to learn these subjects directly from me do contact me and do not forget to subscribe me have a good day bye bye